Ragnar. Ragnar the Red? You've done well, Spyro. Ragnar the Pink. Some dragons thought you weren't ready, but I knew they were wrong. I'm ready, all right. Uh, ready for what? That's the one thing I never understood about the original Spyro game. Ready for what? What is this destiny shtick they keep m mentioning? They never explain. Like, I for... Like, I think I made the joke back when I uh, replayed through uh, Le uh, Spyro 1 on the PlayStation 1. But I 100% fan theory that Spyro the Dragon from Legend of Spyro is the actual one that is mentioned in the legend and they just, like, mis misattributed it to this Spyro. Asher! How you doing, Asher? Thanks for freeing me, Spyro. And now, where was I? In the ice caves. Let's see, I need a few more gems. Oh yeah, because it was that one way that I didn't go, that I need to go back to. We have to get back to Hill Valley! My god, when was the last time I watched Back to the Future? Destiny stuff sounds like sequel bait. But here's the thing, Kazarad. Here's the hilarious thing. The sequel has nothing to do with Destiny. It doesn't mention any prophecy. It doesn't mention anything at all. At most, it's just that Rip, uh, Ripto is like, No! Not dragons! I don't like dragons! And that's it. <laughs> that's literally it. The only one that actually deals with any kind of destiny shtick is, uh... <laughs> is, uh, how do I get up there? I'm a fool. Like, literally, the only one that deals with any kind of destiny shtick is the, uh... Hmm. Is Legend of Spyro. Which is the entire reason that the, uh... diddly do actually, uh... Uh, takes place in Legend of Spyro. So it just... It's so weird because... I never noticed it when I played through this game like three times in a row. But then when I was replaying it on stream like earlier this year... I was like, wait... What the hell do you mean destiny shtick? What is the destiny shtick? What? And then nothing comes of it. Like, unless they're trying to say it's like oh it's your destiny to take out nasty nork is like i don't know it's so out of place it's not elaborated it's just weird it's just super duper weird and no one seems to care to elaborate i've always had trouble navigating this level by the way i've always sucked at navigating this level so, bear with me, please. Despite the fact having 120%ed this game multiple times, I just can't keep the information in my head. Because I suck. But hey, we just gotta take in the aesthetic a bit more. And that's always good. Aesthetic, aesthetic. These are some ugly, <laughs> ugly ass bats. All right, I know! You fool! We did not get all the gems, Spyro. You fool! Oh, do a barrel roll. Oh! We're going back in. <laughs> We're getting all those gems. We're getting all those gems. There's gold in those there mines. I find it funny. Even after all these years, all these time playing this game... I still can't navigate some of these levels for shit. <laughs> and I don't mind. This game is just... 
fan friggin tastic love infinite love infinite love this game is just so good it's just the one third that reminds me my god I have to actually go through and play the other crash games because yeah like I played through crash bandicoot 1 on the insane trilogy but then never did anything with the other two I really need to rectify that. There's no way I'd be able to make it over there, right? No way. Oh my god! My god! <laughs> There's a friggin' light! <laughs> I'm an idiot. That's a little bit of the worry I had. With the game is like all oh, the aesthetic change is gonna make the platforming a little or well, are you gonna hide things I was kind of right I was kind of right could just be me full of 100% except it got thank you could potentially just be me and my stupid ass I'm just I'm just bringing up the possibility die bat you don't belong in this world but just, just, uh, just bring in. Where the where did? Yeah, I was gonna say where the butterfly go? What the hell? Where the dark matter butterfly go? It's supposed to carry me around as I sing a song. I can show you the world. <laughs> that is like a multi-layered joke. That not many people are gonna get. I assume nowadays. In. Oh, I supposed to. Aha! <gasps> mm -hmm. uh -huh. We gotta go back, Morty! We, we gotta go ma back, Morty! We missed the damn key! Mm. It's been, I don't even watch Rick and Morty yet, I do Rick's voice so often, I don't know why. He just comes naturally to me, but I don't get drunk. Yeah, it just in passing with the camera kind of like this. It makes it look not like a ledge. I get it, I'm a fool, but still, I will defend myself slightly, ever so slightly. I can show you the world. Dibbity doo And we'll go and fly through this cavern till we get the gems. And we'll be rich. We'll be so dirty rich. I don't even know where I'm going with that. I'm just losing my mind in the wonderfulness that is this game. Also, for some reason, I find the pitter patter of Spyro running to be incredibly cute. Up in sesame! Yes. We did it! Now we can exit the level! Yay! But seriously, the animation. So good. It's so good! I love it! Play that ASDF clip. I love it! It's just so good. It's just so good. It feels, it plays, it's just so amusing. Also, diddly dang you guys. You made me think that people were talking to me. Hey, this is my cannon. My head cannon. You can't have it. Yeah. Fire! I did it. Let me guess. We need to aim the cannon. We need to aim Buchanan. All right, we'll fire. I just love it so much. This game. This game. I love it so much. It just. It just does, man. It just does. 
everything. And that is just... That makes me wonder, how is the flight stages going to be handled? Because, gotta admit, not biggest fan of the flying stages. Not the biggest fan. Don't like time step too much. But let's go, and let's see what night flight holds for me. A whole new world! The rings look decent. For a moment there, I thought they were kind of like alchemical, like, thingamajigs, and they would be super awesome. Okay. Uh, a little bothered that the camera doesn't, like, super duper follow. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. This, this feels so different. It feels so different from what I remember, and I didn't like these to begin with. Oh, dear lord. It's gonna be so weird. They actually expect you to flap. I do not remember ever flapping in any actual strategic manner in the original. I'm confused. <laughs> he even does the, damn it. Hey there, Spyro. Doing good. Decide to actually finally jump into the Spyro Reignited Trilogy and it is so good. <laughs> The flying stages are a bit wonky, and the some of the platforming early on was a bit weird. Mainly due to the gliding being... Ah, I missed it! Damn it! I was never good at the flying stages. So I can't blame them for my own suck. It's not the Deb's fault. I'm just terrible. But I will do as best I can to suck at the flying stages. Because it feels like they retuned the flying in this game and it feels weird. And I'm doing very bad. I admit that because I've done so terrible. I'm horrible. I'm so bad. The flying stages were never my forte, I freely admit. But how did I get that, like, super boost? Also, like the little twirly does. Like a... That was... That was close. I actually did it right, guys. I didn't suck. <laughs> Now let's see if we can do a good job of uh, getting all the things. I just step. Geronimo! <laughs> I suck. <laughs> I'm so terrible. <laughs> but at least I'm having fun. These actually feel fun. For some reason, in the original, I'm like, ah, oh, man. This is bad. Blurg. But here, I don't know why. I think I'm just so elated. I don't appreciate the dead. I don't know why. I think it's because the aesthetic is so good that, like, the actual colors and design soothe me. It's so good. And it's so much like Saturday morning cartoon, I would watch the, sh the absolute hell out of this. It's just like making me love it so much that I don't get angry at it. I did it again! <laughs> like seriously, I love the look of this. It's so much better than the original visual uh, visually wise. I'm not sure how to properly say that without it being clunky. So I went with maximum clunk. Ash the putter. Okay, remember. Dive, 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 my brother. Ah! 
why? I swear, the, for like 90% of the game, Spyro is quite a casual platformer. It's just that if you want to go 100% that it gets slightly more difficult. The flying stages have always been monsters. <laughs> have always been diabolical and devouring of the soul. Not terrible, not even bad, just difficult. I did it! I need to get my flame timing! I also need to design like a dragon version of me. This makes me want to have a dragon sona. Because I am a silly billy. I feel like the camera can be a little unwieldy at times as well. Not terrible, but just a, just a note. Just a note, Billy Bones! I feel like I'm going really slow. Thank you for the doubles. But we did it! I swear if I miss this. Yay! With one second to spare! Wait, there was an internal shot of Spyro's head? I missed that. I missed that. But it's so good. I love it. It's so nice. Like, even absolutely sucking at the flying stages doesn't hurt anymore. That is amazing. The people behind this game get so much praise for that alone. And it looks so good. It plays so good. I love it. I almost jumped into the tar pit. Oh, no! Oh! Yay, I died in the overworld. I died in the overworld. I am the best spiral player ever. <laughs> uh, I love you too much to even get even slightly angry at that. I love this game. This is... Uh, hey, that even played nicely because I missed those gems. Because I suck. <laughs> I love it. This game so good. I just love it. I enjoy it. It fills my heart with joy. I think I almost killed myself there because I was trying to do the Spyro 2 flippity flappity. You, you, you little monkey. Get back here. Ah, no. uh -huh. I'm not going to play by your rules, I play by my rules, and my rules say, fuck you. Toy f toys for Bob, most well done, Wow! Keep up the good work, and I that know is an fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some- Just toast those enemies and collect <laughs> the treasure. That is an awesome redesign. My god, I love- I love- this game is fueling my artistic wonder. I want to draw these characters in this style because the style is amazing. I love. I love it so much. I miss gems. Oh, never mind. There they are. <laughs> I almost killed myself. Why must I be terrible? Is there like some psychological underline of me wanting to kill myself? Because that's not good. <laughs> 